Uh, that's the piece that came off the tank and three days later after some epoxy it seems to be holding. I got the hose back on, I got it wrapped with some miracle wrap and a pipe clamp on there. Hose clamp. This hose is going to be a problem because it comes up higher than the, where the bed platform is going to be at. So I'm going to have to buy a 90 right there. And then I got to put the hose on the back end of this tank and then we'll test this tank out again, which I really don't have a lot of faith in. But we'll see what happens. Time to get the hose and fill up the tanks. There's my intake. There's my outtake. That elbow right there is my outtake. That's my intake. It comes in underneath Nora's bed here. That's where I wrap it up and store it down there. And then I'm taking it out the door to fill it right now. So this tank will fill up right there. And then once this tank fills up, it'll come out right there. Wrap around the pole and start to fill up down there. Fill up this tank. That's the bleeder air outtake for this tank right now. Um, and then that hose down there will eventually go to my shower. It's just stored up there so it doesn't let all the water out. This old tank is scaring me. We're going to give it a shot. It appears to be working. Water's going in here. It filled up to those two screws right there which is about the height of this hose that wraps around to the other tank and then this tank is now filling which will be just about okay and everything I mean it doesn't have any pressure behind it now but we're dry dry so far both tanks are full and I haven't spotted a leak yet I just strapped some boards down around this tank. This one's already got them. So, it looks like this one used to have a belt around it. It's kind of got a belly on it right there. Hopefully that's all right. Maybe I need to put some support there. But I'm gonna go drive to Home Depot and see if the tanks continue to hold water. That little bit of water right there is from the air bleed I, when I filled the tank all the way up I overfilled it and it bled right out the top so it's working haven't had to put on my life jacket yet <laughs>